City of Austin is holding on to millions of dollars in unclaimed money. Rebates for taxpayers, payments for contractors, and grants for nonprofits are just some of the money that's still out there. KXAN investigator Kevin Clark uncovered records that show even the AISD has not cashed in on money meant for local school projects. At the end of 2019, the city of Austin held $22 million in unclaimed money. Most of that money were checks that were very recently issued. If they're going into the mail on December 31st, they're not going to be cashed until sometime in January. But city controller Diana Thomas says some of that money has been sitting there a while, unclaimed for years. Private citizens especially are difficult to track. The company may have closed. Uh, the people who lived in that prop in that house or at, at that address may have moved. And so we, we don't have a good way to, to follow where they are now. We also found that to be true. A man who hasn't cashed in on a $26,000 Austin Energy rebate check has a listed address at this pack mail. Another man owed nearly three grand has a downtown office building as his address. Even when we found a home address for someone owed money, it got us nowhere. While some people are hard to track down, a large public entity like the Austin Independent School District shouldn't be. Yet records show AISD hasn't cashed in either. Like money for a fitness program at Go Valley Elementary School. Records show AISD never cashed the check from 2016. A bright green future grant for a rainwater project at Woolridge Elementary. The city says that check from nearly a year ago never cleared. The total, more than $5,800 the district has left on the table. Be aware when, when someone owes you money, whether that's the city or another government or even another entity like your utility company. Despite an all day effort, AISD was never able to answer why it has left the money there. The city says for money that isn't claimed, it tries to contact the payee at least once a year. After three years, it turns that money over to the state of Texas. Kevin Clark, KXAN Investigates. To see if Austin is holding any of your money, go to the city's website under the Finance Department section. From there, you can search the unclaimed property list by your name or your business name.